Hello and welcome back to more Bleach. I am here with my reaction to episode 29. Now I'm week two of braces, yay. And I gotta say, I'm really struggling this week more than last week. I don't get it. Well, I do get it. You have to change the tray every week. So maybe this week's tray is just a little bit weird in comparison to last week. I don't know, so please, Bear with me, because I just feel like I sound really funny. Yeah, I don't know. It's just, it's a lot. It's annoying. I don't like it. <laughs> All right, let's waste no more time. Let's delve on into episode 29. I can't believe he got cut down like that. Isn't he our strongest fairy? Although you might be able to kill certain hollows with that type of move, I assure you it will have no effect whatsoever on Soul Reapers. And maybe Soul Reapers as big as him? He's huge! This is a battleground, and by you not fighting to kill, you'll never succeed in stopping anyone! <gasps> That's okay though! Her guardian angel is here! Then why not fight me? I'm sure you'll find it here in my bow. It's a thrill I'd love to give you. And he wants to do this so bad. Quincy versus Soul Reaper. Like, he loves this stuff. Udu's bow. It's totally different from the one I saw before. Both in its appearance and even its spiritual pressure. And that glove. He must have been practicing in order to use it properly. He has been practicing a lot. I'd like to see him versus Ichigo now, because... I feel like he would win, hands down. Either way, I must show you the true form of my Zanpakuto. Time to spread your wings, Tsunzaki Garasu! Yo! I can't remember, did we see this in the last episode? Doesn't matter. See how my countless blades dance through space? No one who has seen my attack has lived. So tell me, do you like what you've seen of my Tsunzaki Garasu? I do kind of like it, but we're going to live to tell the tale 100%. See? Seems unfortunately to be the one who ends up the most long-winded whiner. Absurd. That was just a fluke. You're too cocky for your own you still don't Well, let's try it again why. then, huh? Still talking? Because where flying weapons are concerned, I seem to be the better man. Unfortunately, Uryu wins sight doesn't have as nice a ring to it. And also, Urahime has fairies. I do think that if she had the intent to kill, she could do some real damage. As a fellow practitioner of flying weaponry, you must wish you hadn't met me today. <laughs> no, I think he's just mad and he's gonna come after you. You do realize that I missed you intentionally this time, and also that I won't miss the next time. <laughs> With just a single stroke, you have defeated me utterly. Torture me, destroy me, do whatever you want to me. Well, we're not murderers, though. I don't think we're gonna kill him. Believe me, I have no desire to show mercy to any Soul Reaper. But I don't make a habit out of bullying the weak, either. Now quit your sniveling and get out of here. Imagine thinking you're that powerful, though. Getting taken down, and then he's like, I don't bully the weak. Ooh. <laughs> For you, that is. <laughs> now what? As I suspected, you thought that since you couldn't beat me, you would attack the girl, didn't you? Or were you thinking you would just take her hostage? Oh, big mistake! I don't make a habit of bullying the weak, but I certainly don't mind exposing cowards for what they are. Now I think he's gonna die! He should die. What was he gonna do to her? No one with any pride would ever do such a thing. You coward. I bid you farewell. Oh, God. Yeah, you fucked up. <laughs> wow. He is so strong, like he barely even did anything. He's going to live, but his spiritual powers are no more. <gasps> when he awakens, as a result of this battle, he'll no longer be a soul reaper. Okay, but does that mean that he just has to go and live in the village below then? Udyu didn't want to risk harming any of us until he was able to master it. And to think 
He mastered it to such a degree in only 10 days, all by himself. That's what I'm saying to you, though. He actually mastered his technique, whereas Ichigo is still kind of figuring it out. Orihime. Uh, hang in there, Orihime. Remember, you promised me you would. I remember. Thanks for reminding me, Tatsuki. What's wrong, Orihime? Why are you acting so strange? Did you get hurt in the battle somehow? <laughs> no, I'm just talking to my friend on the other side. It's normal. You know how that happens sometimes when you look into the set? It can even make you sneeze, which is really weird. Like they're not even connected. Uh, I mean, what is that all about? I find that when I look up at the sky long enough, I can actually sneeze. It's a really, really weird thing. Are you sure you're all right? Of course. Why? No reason. He just hasn't been around here long enough. She is always like this. Come back here, you sideburn clown! You're gonna get a beating! For being so ugly! Who you calling ugly? The Soul Reaper with the funky eyelashes is a real looker! I was gonna say Ganji isn't ugly, though. He's generic. That's not nice. <laughs> Did you go? Oh, you found Just him! Time. I could really use some backup right about now! Ganjo! You got a mob chasing you too? Why don't you just get onto the roofs already? Then you can get out of their way! Ganju, Doc! Huh? It's like Kingdom Hearts where we have to take out a thousand Heartless. What are you doing swinging an overgrown blade so close to me, you moron? You almost took my freaking head off! Shut up! I told you to duck, didn't I? What good is a warning if it comes at the same time as the thing you're getting warned about? This is not the time, you guys! I'm totally late. I'm gonna be in big trouble if I don't get there soon. Maybe I should just pretend that I never got the message in the first place and go home. Wait a minute, if this guy ends up in the middle of it, he's not a fighter. Not to my knowledge, anyway. I'll ask these guys if they've seen my group. No, Excuse you're me, stupid! Everybody, but by any chance, have you seen Squad 4 group? Oh, whoa! Hey! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Seriously! <laughs> oh, that didn't work out exactly like I planned it. Wow, this guy's clumsy. Now back oh, off and no! Let's take a little bit! My friend is gonna be missing some pieces! Ah! But I faded the sight of my own blood! And this guy's kind of on Rukia's side, too. Don't worry, this is definitely the right way. I think... Did you just say you think? Oh, don't be grouchy. Hey, turn right up here! You better be correct this time! Why are you following a little girl anyway? Use your own big brain. Good for you. This is it! I'm almost positive! Almost positive? <laughs> well, that fight will take place eventually. We know it. Do what they say, or else I'll be home. Oh. They don't care about him. Do they even know who he is? Come on, you sound like you're scared of us. Uh, yes, please. I think they mean it. Very strange. What the hell are you idiots doing? What is going on here? Why are they acting so confused? We of Squad 11 are led by the strongest captain. As such, we are the strongest unit and always the first into battle. Yeah! Yeah! I just noticed these guys all have weird hair except you. What's your squad again? It's squad four. So wait, are they from like the kind squad? That's right, the rest of us can't stand the little weasels. So whatever you do, don't confuse them with us. Because when it comes to squad four, we hate them. But if you want to kill this one, go right ahead. Oh my God, this is not the plan. What a shame. Oh God, just get him out the way. Like we're in for a fight. Ah. What the hell was that? Was that Chad? What counts is that it just cut the enemy's numbers in half. <laughs> Are we back on the run again? <laughs> Damn it, we should have waited. What's with that stupid outfit you're wearing? Hey, are you with the intruders we saw earlier? Intruders? You saw earlier? Probably, yes. If you think <laughs> you can answer us in riddles and get away with it- He was half honest with you. But I'm afraid I cannot give you that much time. Uh, what? You crazy or something? This won't take five minutes. Only two. Oh! <laughs> You got two minutes to get out of there! Oh, never mind. Maybe not. Squad 12 Captain, I'm sorry, but I must protest. 
Interrogation of patients is strictly prohibited in the Mind your own business! Ah! Master Mayuri... You shut your mouth too, Nemu. Or maybe you'd like me to have you pulled to pieces again. Wait, and I thought the other master was the asshole. This one's even worse. Even though you met and fought against these mysterious invaders in the street, you were defeated in battle and then just retreated like a dog without learning a single shred of useful information? I'm afraid so. <laughs> oh god, don't say that though, he's gonna end up just killing you. You lie. And now you shall receive punishment appropriate to your failure! Oh god. <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh shit, this guy! Are you entitled to discipline members of squads other than your own, Mayuri? Zaraki! I don't like this guy too much. He needs to know his status. Good luck getting anything out of him, Zaraki. Don't just stand there, Nemu, you useless dullard. Let's go! God, she needs to get assigned to a different team. That guy's an asshole. So, how are you feeling, Baldi? I asked you not to call me that anymore. Oh, should it be Mr. Baldi? You little brat! What is the relationship between those two? Why are you hanging out with her? Why is she your lieutenant? I gave him your description, and I told him to be on the lookout for you, Captain. My warning about you did not seem to concern him. Regardless of where you meet him, you will surely enjoy an excellent battle. He's strong now, and from what I saw, I believe his strength is still growing, Master. Isn't it interesting that he'll divulge all this information to him, but not the other guy? His name is... I am Hanataro Yamada. Dude, that, that name, name is, is so lame. lame. What are you talking about? Why is that lame? You might as well call yourself Blossom. Hey, come on. Why should we bother learning the enemy's name anyway? He doesn't exactly look like the enemy. You should reign. I couldn't help it, okay? He was sitting there and I just picked him up huh? and carried him by accident. How do you pick something up by uh... accident? What are you, a garbage man? You just pick up whatever you see lying on the Shut ground? Shut up! Can you guys get along for two seconds? They're never gonna get along, are they? They'll never see eye to eye. What about this map? This would help us avoid running into any more captains out there. If only it showed us where the enemy was. This is a map? It doesn't even have any streets marked on it. I was gonna how is that a map? That's worse than Rukia's drawings. The younger sister of the Squad 6 captain currently being held as a capital offender. And that means the white tower you were talking about must be the repentance cell. He's also looking for her too. Well, you sure seem to be happy, Kenny. Is that so? Yeah, really happy. Ever since you talked to Ikaku back there. That's because he's ready for a fight. He seems always up for these things. Where are you? I, Kenpachi Zaraki, am waiting for you! Come I'm on, so Ichigo ready for that Kurosaki. fight! Oh, I love it, you've got this big badass who, by the way, has Jiraiya's VA. We've kind of gone over this before. If you don't know who Jiraiya is, we can't be friends, I'm sorry. I cannot wait for their big fight together. It's gonna be so, so good. But. He's like the big master, the big leader. He has this really, really cute lieutenant with him that I'm like, what is their relationship, for one? Then you have Ichimara, who's been kind of silent the past couple of episodes. And now we have another helper to get us to Rukia. So it's gonna be good. That was a very, very good episode. It's got this like perfect balance between the happy moments the laugh out moments and then this kind of like serious like we're gonna be fighting really soon ah, kind of moments ah i love this show thank you so so much for watching my reaction today and i'll catch you all in the next one bye